After Kimper was born, um, he had a, a newborn hearing test at the hospital. So we were taken to several other doctors to find out more about his hearing and hearing loss. We'd heard about getting cochlear implants and had done some research on them, and that's kind of the road we decided that we wanted to take. A cochlear implant is truly a bionic ear. It is the only available full replacement for a human special sensory function. When he was born, we found out um, in the hospital before we even left, you know, it kind of took the, the joy and excitement out of having a baby. You know, all of a sudden told that there may be a potential problem with your son. Because, you know, nobody wants to find out that something is, you know, wrong with their child, especially our first child. It's a day surgery type procedure, typically. Maybe small children and babies would spend the night but this surgery takes no more than about an hour and a half to two hours to do. That portion is allowed to heal and then a very specialized computer is used on the outside called the processor. And that processor takes all the sound in the environment, digitizes it and sends it to the implant via an FM signal. And when they first turn him on, he'd never ever heard sound. So um, they start him off very quietly and slow, so not to scare him you know, because it's a whole new world to him. And the second that we had our first appointment with Dr. Peters, he said, uh, okay, you know, my staff will take care of everything, and they did. In the case of Kemper, uh, who was identified early and whose parents wanted to be very proactive, very aggressive, and doing everything they could for him, uh, they presented early on so that by the time um, I saw them and that we had completed all of the evaluations at nine months, not only was he ready for an implant, but I felt he was old enough and he had grown enough that we could do both ears at the same time. It really has changed his life. He turned into a different baby. He was just a lot happier and it's just like his, his whole world kind of opened up. Yeah, we, we think very highly of, of Dr. Peters. Yeah.